Preliminary findings in the 2022 National Research and Experimental Development Report show that the number of researchers in Namibia has increased. There were about 750 in 2014, compared to over 2,500 researchers in 2022. Females make up half of that number in 2022, as opposed to 39% eight years ago. Uh, graduations uh, see more ladies graduating than females. But what is concerning is that that unbalanced social structure that we are seeing, you know, coming, and you know, we want to see how can we really bring that point uh, out to also get motivated so that uh, at least we can have a, that balance, uh, and you know, because it also might bring some. Yes, there have been introduction of uh, programs that are targeting the girl child, and perhaps that is the, the, the outcome that is coming out in um, uh, research of this type. But we are giving, we are getting a picture, uh, and we are sensitized as a country to perhaps feel the gap that is widening in, in, in the society between a girl and a boy child. So we have to do something. And it is our responsibility as the institution of higher learning and also um, those who are involved in research and program development to, to be sensitized on this. It's our way as well as a higher education uh, history. We have been honestly been worried that a boy child is really even been shy now to apply for a position. Uh, the graduation rate also speaks for it. We have seen in the engineering graduation rate, really the boy child is left behind uh, compared to the 90s. Others recommended that subjects that focus on research and experimental development be taught at primary school level to attract boys from a tender age. How do we then tend to help things like coding, programming, and all these things. When do we tend to introduce them at pre-primary, I mean at primary and secondary school level, as of them being only luxurious topics that are to be discussed at tertiary level and going about? We have two major programs in the National Action Plan coming on the capacity building in STEM, so science, um, technology, education, and mathematics for the Namibian child, which will include the capacity building both the boy child and the girl child. The discussion took place at the validation workshop on science, technology and innovation at Svakopmund.